What's up? My name is Jeanette, also known as Misfit Vegan. If you're someone who has difficulty getting in enough greens, okay, then I want to inspire you to check out the sprout section because sprouts have so much dense vitamins, minerals, and nutrients that you might want to get into the sprout life, okay? Having having one or two handfuls of sprouts a day, it's going to give you the same amount of minerals that a whole entire head of romaine or a whole thing of kale or a whole box of arugula would give you, okay? Sprouts are the true superfood. So I wanna just invite you to maybe grow your own or get them at Whole Foods or Sprouts or Trader Joe's or wherever you shop, okay? Personally, I would recommend you go for the organic ones because they just seem to taste better personally and of course they have no pesticides on them. But organic doesn't mean no pesticides, it just means they use organic pesticides, okay? So organic is always best, but if you can't afford the organic because they are double the price, literally, then get the regular ones, okay? Trust me, look at that. It says no pesticides. So there you go. Th this company seems to have the exact same label on the sprouts. It says all natural, non-GMO, no pesticides, no preservatives, no additives. All natural, non-GMO. So you know, it looks exactly the same. Some of my absolute favorite sprouts are definitely clover sprouts. I love sunflower, but they don't sell those here. I've never seen them in a store. It's very, very rare. I saw them in like one store. But um, I would also recommend you check out the mung bean sprouts. They're really good in like pad thai. You got the beet sprouts, which are really cool and beautiful. Uh, the sprout mix, which is nice. You can get this crunchy mix as well, which I like sometimes just so it gives like some a crunch to your salad. You know, you used to have croutons in your salad and now you have the sprouts. Something that I really love so much is the microgreens that they sell here and they are expensive, but they're worth it. Oh, by the way, sumos are here early this year. I'm just saying, that's crazy. But come all the way over here to the packaged salad section and check out those. This is let me tell you, this is luxury right here, okay? When I eat these in my salad, I feel like a billionaire. I don't even have to have the money in the bank. I just put this on top of a salad, I feel like a million bucks. They have a new flavor, by the way, wasabi mustard, which obviously is pretty spicy, but they also have broccoli, spicy mix, which isn't really spicy. I like the rainbow mix the best. And yeah, that's what I recommend if you can't get in enough greens now yesterday on misfit mondays we talked about the greens in the plastic uh, containers are they washed are they not washed well we talked about it and you probably missed it because you're not a member so boo boo guess what click the link below and check out misfit mondays it's a place where you can come to connect with your fruity family all over the world raw and high raw vegans that are eating a fruit-based diet and we connect every single Monday on our Misfit Mastermind call. And you missed it. And so there's a lot of information. We have a lot of fun. We always laugh. And we also learn a lot. I learn a lot every single week. And I know everybody that comes does as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. You know I'm going to get some tomatoes. You already know. I mean, look at this bounty. Whew. This is gorgeous. What an amazing world we live in. Can we just take a moment to recognize how fucking blessed we are? that we have farmers that are picking this stuff for us too early so that we could buy it and it can never ripen. No, I'm just kidding. We have farmers that are helping us out on the daily. We could just go to the store and buy whatever we want. Like this is unheard of in the history of the human species. We've never had it this good ever. And I just want you to take a moment to recognize that. Thank you guys so much. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye boo.